Hello everybody, welcome to Dakman Productions and welcome to the Greenberg Train Show here at the Greater Philadelphia Expo Center and Oaks, Pennsylvania. So we are here today for this wonderful train show. We're going to check it out. One of my viewers had mentioned that I probably should go over why uh, mention the people why I play music in my videos and that's for privacy uh, so the vendors can talk and conduct business while I'm filming and not have to worry about private information being exposed and uh, they appreciate that but we're going to get started today and we're going to check out the show.
Don't you be stealing my cars, Jeff. I'm trying. <laughs> I don't know if I have that one or not. I've, I, I run into the same thing. That's why I, uh, I take pictures of what I have so I can look back and <laughs> you see know, if I, I have that or not. I have a list of all my engines, but I don't have a list of all my rolling stuff. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm going to have to... Uh, Doug, Doug's got a list of everything.
everybody, I'm back from the Greenberg train show from Oaks, Pennsylvania at the Greater Philadelphia Expo Center. Great event. I'd like to thank everybody who came up to me and said hello. Actually, <laughs> it was more or less my experience this time around at the train show. It was like going to a family reunion picnic. You know, people coming up, hey, black man, how you doing? How's your layout making out? How you doing? You know, it's like, it's just like, uh, you know, going to a family reunion picnic. So, yeah, I consider you guys family because, you know, you guys have been watching me for so long. Appreciate that. Um, <laughs> it's, it's, it was just a wonderful experience. So, yes, I did come home with some goodies. So, normally when I go to these shows, people ask me all the time, are you looking for something specific? No, if it hits me, I'll buy it. If not, I just go to mingle, say hello to everybody, uh, say hello to the vendors, and and so forth and so on. I just like the train show experience in itself. And this time around, I did find a couple things that said, Dak Man, buy me. <laughs> so, what did I come home with? Well, let's open up this first one here. Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. This is. I like this one. So again, certain things do strike me. Whether it's prototypical or not, I don't know. I just liked it and I bought it. So here I have a scale-sized Lionel PS1 uh, single-door box car. This is a scale piece. The PS1 is a 40 foot box car, if I remember correctly. And uh, it's in the Lindy Industrial Gases uh, name. I bought this from a vendor called the O Gauge Man, and he gave me a heck of a deal on this. So, uh, on the box, it's marked uh, $44. Originally, it was $80. So, it was marked down from $80 to $44. Actually, which was a good deal. And so I picked it up. I didn't even say a word and I handed it to him. He and he says, okay, you can give me $25 for it. I'm like, $25? He goes, yeah. I'm like, wow, thank you very much. I wasn't I wasn't going to haggle or anything. And he gave me a deal. I said, I really appreciate this deal you're giving me. He goes, he goes, I know who you are, you're Dark Man Productions, and you go around and you promote this hobby. And he says, you know, I'm going to give you a deal for doing what you do, for promoting the hobby and the shows and the vendors. I'm like, oh, I really appreciate it. I wasn't expecting it, but it was great that he did that for me. Thank you to the O-Gage Man. Uh, you'll find him as a vendor at Oaks Greenberg and Europe train show. I'm not sure where else he goes, but those are the places I see him at all the time. Next one we have. Let's see what we got. We have an Atlas O 17,000 gallon or 17,360 gallon uh, tank car and the Hooker Chemicals road name. This is the Master Series. Very, very nice tank car. I was looking at buying this from Mr. Muffins. However, when I went to the Greenberg Eggs show, Nicholas Smith was there, and they had it. And I'm like, yeah, I'll just buy it here. That way I don't have to pay for shipping. And it was a pretty good price, too. They had this marked at $45. $45. That's cheap for this. These cars are... 80 to 90 dollar cars all day long so you can find deals at these train shows and uh nicholas smith disappeared from the train show scene for a while but they're back they're coming back to the shows so make sure if you see them actually make sure you pay them a visit this is a brand new piece 45 dollars brand new I just can't express how cheap that is. That is half the cost of what these cars are going to go for. So, again, you can get the deals if you shop at these train shows. 
yeah, there's some prices that are like eBay, but then you got prices that I just proved that you can buy um, certain things reasonably. I like to give an honorable mention to Pete Costa. He was there. I always enjoy talking to Pete. Pete has some great prices on Lionel. Great pricing. It's going to be hard to beat him in pricing. So, if you go into the train shows, uh, he normally goes to Oaks, Edison, and York as well. Look for Pete Costa. He's willing to give you guys a deal. Great guy to talk to and chat with. If you want to pre-order something, he'll pre-order it for you as well. And the second runner-up honorable mention goes to Westchester Trains. Uh, he's another vendor that sells at the uh, Oaks, Greenberg, Edison, and the York Show as well. He buys and sells collections, so again, you never know what he's going to have. He's got these great pieces he comes up with. Um, so check him out when you're at the shows. And if you go through the video that you just seen, you'll see that I have and did post business cards to where... You know, okay, Westchester has these trains, Peak Costa has these. Uh, I got a picture of the banner of Nicholas Smith. So I do try uh, Cookery Clack, uh, almost forgot them, was there. He had a huge assortment of post war, pre war tin plate, uh, modern, NPC. So he had a whole bunch of stuff as well. Then I almost forgot the Texas model train collectors. Uh, he travels the country buying and selling. Another great guy to talk to and chat with. So if I forgot you, I'm sorry, but it's kind of late tonight. And uh, again, appreciate you guys watching these videos. Really helps out the channel. And uh, we'll catch you at the next train show. We'll catch the track side. Goodbye.